afternoon and welcome to another episode of Bubba's Garage. I hope you guys are having a fabulous day. Guys, today we're going to make a quick mod on our 2020 Runaway Venturist. If you notice back in 2021, back in, it is 2021, but early in January when Runaway came out with their new 2021 Runaway Campers, there was a really interesting mod that they actually had, and that is the Diamond Plate AC cover. They have that standard on all their rigs now, and I just wanted to get that same exact mod installed on my 2020 Runaway. Guys, you could do this mod too. If you have a 2020, a 2019, it doesn't matter. Any year model, this mod will actually work for you. And what it does is it gets rid of this AC cover. I'm gonna take this cover off. I'm gonna show you something. You know, how many times have you gone out, you're out boondocking or you're out camping or something like that, and you go to turn that AC on and you forget to take this cover off? It's happened to me on many occasions and you don't wanna burn up that AC. Well, this AC mod will prevent you from having to worry about that. One of the most important things about this mod is you need to get some measurements to send over to Runaway so that they can build one of these for you. And what you do is actually pretty simple. You're gonna take, you're gonna, you see this frame that goes around, all the way around your AC. This is what you're gonna measure. Now keep in mind, this is a 2020, but even the wood models are pretty much the same. It's just different types of materials. You're gonna measure from the outside of the frame all the way to the outside of the frame. And you're gonna do that exact same thing up and down. This is your height, right? Outside of the frame, all the way down to the bottom on the outside of the frame. Now you don't have to worry about if you have an angle cut out right here, you don't really have to worry about that. What you need to do is get the height of that frame. Once you do that, there's only one other measurement and it is the depth from the frame all the way to the corner edge of your AC unit. See, the AC units change over time. Manufacturers change their products and things like that. There'll be a different depth, there'll be a different height, there'll be different width. So over time, Runaway has to change different models. So it's very important for you to take those measurements on the outside of the frame, outside of the frame, so this is your width, and this is your height, and then this is your depth. Very, very, very important. Once you get those measurements and you send those over to Runaway, they'll build to build you an AC cover to match. So once you get the measurements, this is the outcome. And that is a custom AC cover that you get to match those specifications for your rig. But in addition to, you get three aluminum angle brackets. Now, one of those brackets is longer than the other two, and that's because that bracket is gonna go on the top. So then you have the other two shorter ones that are gonna go on the sides. Let me show you something. So if you take take one of these angle brackets, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take these brackets, you're gonna put it right across the top, you're gonna make sure it's nice and flush there. And if you notice, I have a little mark in the center and that's because I just took some measurements, the center of the bracket, as well as the center of the framing piece so I can line things up fairly easy. Now we did pre-drill some of our holes, we just pre-tapped them just so that we can line things up and it'll look a little bit better on the outside of the frame, once you put your pieces on, then your screws will actually be proportional. I don't know, you don't really have to be that picky. It does come with the self-tapping screws, so pre-drilling and piloting those holes really don't matter. You can eyeball it, you can get them lined up. I'm not really good at eyeballing things, so Bobby's gotta take a lot of measurements for me and cross-check me twice because I always get it wrong. But that's pretty much it, that is all it is. So now what we're going to do is we're going to take, we're going to install this on the rig. I don't expect it to take very long. And I hope not because I believe we have some rain coming. So let's get to installing this. Wake up. Step into the world outside. The future never looks so bright. Can't you hear it calling us? Let go, leave all of your cares behind You never know where you might find Sunny days are coming up Dreaming of tomorrow, soaking up the sun We can sit and talk about it Oh, we could run away, 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 away We don't have to stay, we could run away Away, 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 away Oh, we could run away, run away 
sky Come with me to paradise Can't you hear it calling us? That's about it for the insulation. Now you will need to go ahead and put a bead of silicone all the way around the AC cover to help prevent water from getting into your AC itself. However, we're not going to do that right here on Bubba's Garage because we do have a storm coming in in the next hour from the hurricane over in Louisiana. You guys, the most important thing that you want to make note here is the dimensions. You want to measure from the outside of the frame to the outside of the frame, both on the width as well as the height. Now on the depth, you're going to measure from the frame to the end of the AC unit. And don't worry about giving overages or anything like that. Runaway campers will have you covered on that. Now outside of that, it's actually a really easy installation. Now we pre-drilled and pre piloted our holes. Um, I do highly recommend that. I would also recommend piloting your holes uh, into your frame. It just keeps everything lined up. The downside is you got to take your time on those measurements and if you don't have someone else to double check you, then double check yourself, take your time. Guys, um, if you want to order one of these, definitely reach out to Runaway Campers. They'll get you set up, but make sure that you have those dimensions set up correctly. Outside of that, guys, um, we're going to wrap up this video. If you wanted to learn more about our rig right here on Bubba's Garage, do me a favor. Check the link there in the eye of the sky and I have an entire playlist on all the mods that we made to our rig, as well as in the description down below. Now, we are going to be at Texas Outdoor Expo this fall in October. If you guys are there, feel free to come by. Uh, you can take a look. You can browse around or ask any questions that you might have. Now, honestly, if you leave some comments, I'll definitely reply as well. Guys, if you like this video, please give us a huge, huge, huge thumbs up. And if you really like this video and you want to stick around to find out what happens next, right here on Bubba's Garage, please subscribe. And until next time, we'll see you on the flip side. Good night, everybody.